Frank McGee is on the case in Uncanny and Humans issue 15. So beginning a new story post Civil War 2, Uncanny and Humans 15 centers around Frank McGee retelling the death of fellow inhuman partner of his Ahuran to her two daughters as well as how they both met and became partners. Since her death Frank has been looking after Oren's two daughters who have kind of become his new family since Frank lost all of his family once he became an inhuman. It's not long before his surrogate children try to make contact with their mother by using readers powers. So ever since I started reading about Frank in the early issues of this book I've really wanted a detective type book with him as the main character you know solving inhuman related crimes and misdoings. Now he's written like a really classic private eye character and it's really great contrast to the sci-fi kind of fantasy world that he inhabits with the Inhumans and everything and it's really great seeing him wandering around you know he dresses like a classic private eye with the coat and the, the tie and the suit and everything and it's a really great contrast to you know Black Bolt and Medusa who wear these superhero costumes and everything it's really really different I really like it and I'm really looking forward to the next issue I'm going to give this issue an 8 out of 10 Hey everyone, thanks so much for watching my latest video, hope you enjoyed it. While you're here, why not check out another one of my reviews, like and subscribe my channel for more reviews and videos, and follow me on Twitter at Matt underscore FOS. Thanks guys, and I will see you all next time.